Hello everybody, I am Snop Anybody Mac Fiegel, and in collaboration with Northerner.com I will do a review of uh, this Crafted Snooze Crafted Carders Highland Single Cot from AG Snooze blended by Connie Anderson Good, so we'll have a look at the can design uh, and the snooze and we'll do the scent profile and taste afterwards. So let's have a look at the snooze. Good. Here's the can. And on top it says blended by Connie Anderson, made by AG Snooze since 1864. Crafted Cardis Highland Single Cock. Beautiful design. And on the side you get the Crafted Cardis. You get the 100% lamina, small batch carders, uh, and signed off by Connie Anderson. And again, more crafted and a warning label. Good. So, let's have a look at this news. There you have it. This is what single cot looks like. So, this is not a ground but a cot tobacco. And it's fluffy, it's nice, and it's moist. You can see some big pieces. There was just one there, and we can't dig it out again. But no worries. This is what it looks like. This is a fairly hot snooze to hand bake. But it doesn't matter, because it sticks together and holds together very well in the lip. Good. Now, let's have a talk about taste and sip. Okay, let's crack this little one. Yeah. The scent is complex. Yes, it, it smells like whiskey. It smells like bold tobacco. It's a wee bit peaty, but it's and it's smoky as well, and has a sort of fruity sweetness in its scent. Oh, this smells so good! Yeah, and when you've got it in a good prilla in the lip, and I bake about a gram, a gram and a half of this at a time. Um. It tastes like whiskey at first because uh, this is cased with a very good whiskey uh, but the casing is at least by me sucked off in the first five minutes and then you don't get the casing anymore <clears throat> ah, a wee drink of coffee here okay and afterwards no, this snooze doesn't taste like whiskey tastes, but it tastes exactly like a high quality whiskey smells. It's got that deep, uh, deep, yes, the, the malty, uh, malty with a wee bit of sweetness to it. Uh, it has that, and it's it's fun to talk about velvet. Uh, as a taste, but it has that velvet smooth taste of excellent blended whiskey. There is smokiness to this, and the impressive thing about this snooze is actually that none of these tastes comes from the casing after the first five minutes, but it comes from the very high quality craftsmanship that has gone into blending this snooze because all the taste comes from the different kinds of tobacco here and it's a very good snooze it tastes brilliant and I like it but it's bold it's it's all in this snooze it has so much flavor that it becomes almost overbearing um, at least I can handle this snooze as an all-day, everyday snooze. This is something I pick up once in a while when I want to indulge myself. And, you know, 
kind of do the extreme premium thing. Because it doesn't get much better than this. At least not in my point of view. So, if you love tobacco, and if you like whiskey, this is a brilliant snooze, which gets my highest recommendations. But if you're a sn if you like snooze and you like your snooze like mellow tobacco, this is not what you want. This is all in tobacco, super delicious snooze. Yeah, that's all I've got to say. Brilliant snooze, good work by Connie Anderson. Goodbye.